Elizabeth Raby was, and I quote, raised in a junkyard. That was where her first love of mosaics was born, in the place where all the broken things come to roost, waiting to be put together, reborn, as art. Since then, Raby has become Mendocino County's consummate mosaic artist. It seems every mosaic in Ukiah has been facilitated by Raby, completed in her studio, or somehow has passed through her mosaic guru goddess queendom. Visiting her home to interview her for our podcast episode, I was treated to a tour of her space which doubles as an art gallery for many of her pieces. I heard how each creative work has a backstory from Elizabeth's own life, a narrative full of feeling and meaning. Her home is teeming with her drawings, sketches, paintings, and of course multiple mosaics that she has created over the years. Raby has manifested her dream studio that is large enough to house a plethora of tiles and tile bits to be used in her own artwork and is also available for students to use in their own pieces in her grout camp workshops where folks learn firsthand how to create a mosaic. As a poet myself, I particularly felt drawn to several pieces in which Raby had embedded a poem into the tile work. Some pieces have leftist political motifs, others are pure whimsy, and all of them tell a visual story. Mosaics are a delight to behold, evocative of many pieces with a unified theme. One of the mosaics in her world was actually created in large part at a musical Mother's Day event I co-produced at my place back in the day. Folks came and added pieces to a goddess-themed mosaic that was being built at the back of the concert bowl. Part of what I appreciate most about Raby's love of mosaics is her desire to spread the craft, involving everyone in the artist's journey. In addition to her own artistic pursuits, Raby has collaborated with the Arts Council of Mendocino County to get many hands to help with large-scale mosaic projects. Visiting downtown Ukiah, one can't help but stumble upon one of Elizabeth's art pieces. In addition to two different mosaics adorning the walls of local establishments, Raby recently took on the task of beautifying all of the trash cans in the Alex Thomas Plaza. Each piece reflects some of the beauty and charm of Mendocino County, representing local scenes, the native Poma practice of preparing acorns for food, cows grazing the grassy hills, good times at the local dog park, merrymaking at a musical jam session, a Mendo Gothic couple wearing pandemic masks while brandishing their cannabis crop, the tranquility of the city of 10,000 Buddhas, children enjoying fresh strawberries, squirrels in love, and many more. After the Redwood Complex fires, Raby helped support an Art from the Ashes project with contributions from fire survivors and the community affected by the fires, working together to create a mosaic that is featured on the side of the Redwood Valley Grange. Raby also helped people who had a small pile of broken dishes and things that were able to be salvaged in pieces after the fires to create cathartic mosaic artwork from their former possessions. The Redwood Complex fires took my home, and so I appreciate the artwork that came forth in the wake of the tragedy to help us rise as phoenixes from the ashes. Although Elizabeth is our local mosaic champion, she also has been featured as a nationally and internationally recognized artist. In addition to her recurring work with the Society of American Mosaic Artists, she has been a visiting instructor to colleges and art schools throughout the country. Several states feature her artwork, and she has been featured on NBC News and on the cover of Art Week magazine. Additionally, she has been instrumental in teaching abroad, and some of her pieces are on public walls in Germany and Chile. We're lucky in Northern California to have such a prolific mosaic artist in Elizabeth Raby, and I hope you'll tune into our interview on the Positive Fantastic podcast, episode 15, in which we explore her artistry and current grout camp offerings in more depth. You can visit anchor.fm slash morinatura or listen in on your favorite podcast platform. Cheers, and may your journeying be fantastic.